focus on your joy. And when I'm saying focus on your joy, what do I mean? It means focus on the things that are working out well, even when other things that you're longing for aren't working out well. Some of us moan and complain about all the things that we're trusting God for, all the things that we're hoping for, all the things we plan for, that aren't working out well, whereas God is doing other things in your life. I know someone in this church who, at some point, they were struggling with um, having a child. And eventually, God came through, and the person sent a text message, and he was saying, when we were struggling with this thing, God was at work in our lives in this way. God was providing for us. God was growing our business. God was doing other things for us. So that even though we didn't have this thing that we're trusting him for, he was doing other things in our lives. Focus on your joy. Focus on the things that God is doing in your life. In the gospel, you are not defined by what you do not have. You are defined by whose you are. Yeah, so maybe somebody hasn't professed love to you, but guess what? The person who matters most in the whole world has professed his own love to you. Guess what? He even went a step further and gave his own life for you. Your boyfriend will never do that. <laughs> 